Once upon a time, deep within a serene forest, lived a young boy named Mango. Mango was a spirited and imaginative boy who found great joy in the company of his animal friends. Among them was slowly, a wise and gentle turtle with a heart full of kindness. As the forest race day approached, an air of excitement enveloped the woodland. Every year, the animals of the forest would gather to partake in a lively race, showcasing their agility and swiftness. Unfortunately, Slowly always found himself lagging behind, and this year, he yearned for a change. He longed to show everyone, including himself, that he could be faster. I can do it. I want to go faster, he said to himself. Observing his friend's determination, Mango's eyes sparkled with an idea. Slowly, my dear friend, let us find a way to make you go faster, Mango proposed with unwavering belief. Slowly's eyes widened with a mix of hope and curiosity. Though he had trained diligently for a whole year, his efforts had not yielded the desired results. Nevertheless, he trusted Mango's boundless optimism and readily agreed. With enthusiasm filling their hearts, Mango and Slowly set out on their quest. They roamed through the forest, seeking inspiration from the wonders of nature. One day, as they rested beneath a towering orange tree, a ripe orange fell and rolled across the ground. The sight of the orange's smooth rolling motion sparked a revelation within Mango's mind. Slowly, my friend, do you see how the orange effortlessly rolls? It gives me an idea. What if we could invent something round that would help you move swiftly? Mango suggested, excitement gleaming in his eye. That is a wonderful idea. Slowly's eyes widened with intrigue. With renewed hope, they embarked on a quest to find the perfect solution. They scoured the forest, exploring every nook and cranny, hoping to stumble upon an object or idea that could unlock Slowly's hidden potential. However, their journey was far from easy. They encountered numerous challenges along the way. Dense undergrowth obstructed their path, making it difficult to move forward. The scorching sun beat down upon them, draining their energy. They faced steep slopes, slippery rocks, and unexpected encounters with mischievous woodland creatures that tested their resolve. Despite the difficulties, Mango and Slowly persisted, their determination unyielding. They encouraged each other, sharing words of motivation and support as they searched for inspiration. Mango's quick thinking and resourcefulness often came to the rescue, guiding them through seemingly insurmountable obstacles. Then, one day, as they traversed a particularly treacherous part of the forest, they stumbled upon an abandoned hollow log. The log was weathered and worn, but it held a hidden secret, a collection of smooth, round stones that resembled the rolling orange they had seen before. Eyes gleaming with excitement, Mango and Slowly carefully selected the stones. They imagined attaching them to Slowly's shell, transforming them into wheel-like devices that would enhance his speed. With the stones securely fastened, Slowly cautiously took his first steps, feeling the newfound freedom and agility beneath him. Wow, I have never go this fast before, he said with a glimmer of joy spread across his face. Mango's heart swelled with pride as he witnessed his friend's transformation. They had overcome countless challenges and finally found a solution that would propel Slowly to new heights. Days turned into weeks and Mango and Slowly toiled tirelessly, refining their invention. They experimented with different wheel arrangements until they achieved the perfect balance and functionality. Their unwavering determination and shared enthusiasm kept them going, despite any obstacles they encountered. Slowly embarked on an intensive training regimen, pushing himself to the limits each day. He focused on building his strength, honing his balance, and mastering the technique of racing with the wheel shoes. Mango, ever the supportive friend, cheered him on, offering words of encouragement and guidance throughout the challenging training sessions. As the day of the race arrived, Mango and Slowly stood side by side at the starting line. The forest was buzzing with anticipation as the competitors prepared themselves for the exhilarating challenge that lay ahead. The race commenced, and Slowly propelled himself forward, gliding smoothly on his wheel shoes. Mango, filled with a determination of his own, sprinted alongside his friend. As the racers weaved through the forest, Mango's keen eyes scanned the surroundings, ready to assist any animal in need. When Hoppy the rabbit stumbled, 
Caught in a thicket of brambles, Mango swiftly came to her rescue, untangling her from the prickly mess and setting her back on track. Meanwhile, Slowly's newfound speed astonished the other participants. He zoomed past them, leaving them in awe of his incredible transformation. As they raced forward, a mischievous squirrel darted across the path, causing a momentary distraction for the other racers. Several animals stumbled, their progress hindered by the sudden commotion. However, Mango's quick reflexes and keen senses allowed him to anticipate the squirrel's antics. With a swift leap, Mango managed to catch the squirrel mid-air, saving it from colliding with the other racers. He gently placed the squirrel on a nearby branch, ensuring its safety. In that split second of assistance, Mango's fellow racers gained a renewed sense of determination, grateful for his selfless act. Meanwhile, slowly maintained his swift pace, gliding gracefully with his wheel shoes. The forest terrain presented unexpected twists and turns, challenging his ability to maneuver through the obstacles. But Mango, always by his side, offered timely guidance, helping slowly navigate the tricky sections with ease. As they approached the final hurdle, an imposing fallen tree lay across the path, its branches creating a formidable barrier. Mango and Slowly faced the challenge head-on, their spirits undeterred. Slowly braced himself, preparing to climb over the fallen tree. I can do it. It is almost there. But his legs were having difficulties reaching up and the wheels were not helping in this instance. But Mango had a different idea. He motioned Slowly to step back. Then, using all his strength, Mango grabbed hold of a sturdy vine from a nearby tree, he extended his hand to Slowly, inviting him to climb aboard his back. With Mango's assistance, Slowly hopped onto Mango's back, and together, they swung themselves over the fallen tree, landing on the other side. Thank you, Mango. Without you, I won't be this far. Slowly said sincerely. Mango smiled. You are welcome, my friend. It is fun. Let's finish the race together. The forest echoed with cheers and applause as the animals witnessed their display of teamwork and courage. In the final moments of the race, Mango and Slowly crossed the finish line hand in paw, their triumphant smiles mirroring each other's joy. The forest erupted with cheers and admiration for the remarkable duo. They had not only achieved their individual goals but had also touched the lives of every creature that witnessed their incredible journey. The forest race had come to a close, but Mango and Slowly's impact continued to resonate within the hearts of all who had witnessed their unwavering determination and acts of kindness. They had shown that true victory transcends personal achievement and lies in the spirit of camaraderie support, and the belief that together, anything is possible. From that day forward, Mango and Slowly became revered figures in the forest. Their story was shared far and wide, inspiring future generations of racers to embrace the power of collaboration and compassion. The wheel shoes they had invented became a symbol of ingenuity and unity, reminding all who wore them that they carried a piece of Mango and Slowly's remarkable journey. Thank you for watching. Please support by subscribing to this channel. Stay tuned for more interesting stories.